Hey, what's happening, everybody? This is Yummy Mash, and uh, today I'm bringing you a Gears War 3 commentary. Got a couple of these uh, shotgun and sniper gameplays for you because honestly, guys, this game type is freaking amazing in my opinion. Um, I ha I get so stressed playing team deathmatch, but when I come on shotgun and snipers and play this for a little bit, I have such a better time, and it's just so much more fun. And, and just in my opinion, I love the sniper. Anyway, what I want to talk about today, then for the next six seven minutes, is uh, a topic that um haven't talked about before and it's something that affects most people or a lot of people during childhood and going through high school or school or whatever and it's uh, bullying and um, you know I had a couple of friends who um, had this had this problem and um, I, I it never it never really affected me badly at all uh, and here's the thing uh, I like I said many times I was never you know the pinnacle of coolness at school uh, people people thought I was a bit of a nerdy geek blah 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 which I was I'll admit it I was and uh, the thing is though um, I never really got picked on uh, ever physically nobody ever touched me and um, the only time I had a fight was um, <laughs> was outside the library when I uh, took on this uh, took on this guy and you know I spoke about this before and it, you know, like I said it didn't end very well uh, I tripped over got kicked a few times um, but as you know verbal abuse you know sometimes you know I've had that I've had verbal uh, abuse to me and um, I, I, I don't really take it to heart, I just don't really listen to it, but I had a friend, I had a, a friend of mine, he sat by me in Tutor, and I haven't spoken to him in oh, many years now, maybe four or five years, it's been a long time. Uh, the sad thing is, and I know this, uh, this, this happens to a lot of people, well, everyone I think, is when you leave, when you leave school or when you leave college, a lot of your friends there, you'll never speak to them again or you won't speak to them for many, many years, and it's sad really, because he, he was a really, really nice guy, I really liked him and um, honestly I just completely forgot what his phone number is and I just can't remember where he lives um, he, he was such a cool guy and there's another person actually another friend of mine who I haven't spoken to in years as well which I really want to one day speak to again and I wonder how he's doing but that's in the past now I'm just looking to the future and um, but anyway this friend of mine you know, I sat by him in tutor and um, one day you know the tutor comes in a little late sometimes and there was n nobody was there no teachers or whatever and this guy goes up to him and I think he like uh, slaps him on the face or something and he flips he absolutely flips he grabs the guy uh, on this shirt on the shirt and he starts punching him in the face and br I think he breaks his nose with me, like his nose was bleeding and I was like whoa well that's some good shit right there you're standing up for yourself you know standing up to the bully um, punching him in the face that that shows that shows that's just awesome, that's what I thought. And, you know, it was just a absolute flip afterwards. You know, he was crying a bit, and uh, he, he went out of the class. And um, I think um, the person who got punched in the face actually got in trouble, but my friend who punched him in the face didn't really get in trouble. I, I It was a bit weird. I don't know how things work in terms of rules and stuff, but uh, I, was, I was sure that, you know, punching someone in the face from a little slap, well, whatever it was, it was a long time ago, I can't remember exactly, it is a little, um, a little too much. Uh, I, I studied uh, a bit of law, and um, when, let's say, you were to commit a crime in anger or passion or something, de depending on what's happened, like, if somebody was to punch you in the face, it's like self-defense, if somebody was to punch you in the face, you punch them back in the face, you don't shoot them or stab them or something, because that is much worse than getting punched in the face. You know, you do to them kind of what they do to you, and, and that's how I think it works. So, uh, it did surprise me a little, um, <laughs> it did surprise me a little. So, um, yeah, bullying is a, is a crazy thing because usually, um, when 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 somebody's you know is getting picked on, and you know, I had, I've had a few friends who uh, suffers from this, and you know, they don't really like to talk about it. But um, when you get picked on, um, y you don't really want to. You know, they'll say to you, if you tell any teacher, I'm gonna fuck you up. So you don't want to tell any teacher. And you know, they the teachers say, if you know, if anything's wrong, come to us. We'll help you out. But they don't. They're not there all the time, are they? They're not there all the time. So when things go downhill and you're getting uh, picked on, you're getting, uh, you know, uh, abused, verbally abused, assaulted, whatever. You don't want to go to a teacher because you think the consequences are going to be even worse than saying uh, saying anything. And uh, that's the thing. And you know, a few of my friends are, you know, I I know they were, you know. I know they were getting uh, bullied a bit, and they didn't, you know, didn't talk about it to anyone. And sometimes I'd, I'd say to them, you know, I'd just say to the teacher about it, and you know, they'll they'll get a telling off. But they just didn't want to, and that's that's the thing. Um, 
obviously you know it doesn't it doesn't affect um it doesn't really affect people after after school because you know college and uh, everything after that people are more mature people don't do it uh i haven't come across anything like it since i've left school but you know it's it is a problem it is a problem but my, my word of advice on this uh, subject is just just to stay strong because you know in school they may be they may be cooler they may be stronger they may be all this but after education when you are when you're getting the a's and you're getting into universities and you're getting the good jobs and they're there working at mcdonald's or whatever not not like mcdonald's is a bad place but you know what i'm saying you're gonna have the last laugh they may be physically stronger than you but you have the brains um, so that's that's my word of advice. So don't let it get to anybody. If any of you have you know get picked on or ever been picked on, just don't let it get to you. It's 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 just it's just you have to put it underneath you. You know, it's something that I, I just think doesn't need to you know completely destroy you inside because you're better than that. You're all better than that. Um, not all of you. Wow, you're all you're all better than that, obviously. Uh, so that is my my word on bullying. Um, and whatever I thought I'd talk about it um, I kind of in a way wish maybe I was bullied a bit so I could talk about it more from you know from deep within my heart but I wasn't which is kind of strange really um, I'll tell you about this one quick story actually um, me and my friend we were on our little bikes you know I was about about 12 years 12 years old and it was on, I was on my bike with my friend and uh, this gang of about six or seven people came up to me, my friend biked away, and there I was in the middle of this giant bike gang. They surrounded me, I couldn't get out. And the leader comes up to me, punches me in the stomach, and then they all bike away laughing as I'm running home crying, holding onto my stomach, winded and stuff. It was horrible. I was only like 12 though, but you know, that was horrible. I never met these guys before, and I didn't even know who they were. They just decided to just punch this random kid in the stomach. They just decided to pick on me, and uh... It was a bit stupid, but anyway guys that is the end of this then I sure hope you enjoyed not only the gameplay, but the commentary too. Nice double there by that guy Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all very soon. Goodbye guys